Hello, my name is Brandon with DocParser, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to extract data from an image. DocParser comes really handy when a business case needs to extract data from an image. Not just that, but DocParser can convert scan images like JPEG, PNG, and TIFF files into Excel also. Converting these file types to Excel with DocParser is as simple and can be done in these easy steps. This entire process is actually very similar to converting a PDF document to Excel. The only difference is that we're now working with an image file type. Once logged in, the first step is to create a document parser by selecting the type of document you want to parse. For this tutorial, I'll actually be extracting data from a JPEG, so I'm going to click the custom category. Next, I'm going to give it a name and then click continue. The file I'll be using in this tutorial is a sample trade spreadsheet of stock data in JPEG format. Next, browse to the location of the file to upload, and then click Continue. On this screen, I'll select Table Data as it closely matches the type of data that I want to parse. On this screen, you can see four red vertical lines, which will act as margin lines to section off certain columns of data. I'll start off by dragging the first line to the start of the first column, and then proceed with each vertical line thereafter. I'll be sectioning off the first five columns of this sheet. You can add a new vertical line by clicking the red button on the left side of the screen. And as you can see, I'm adding new vertical lines to section off each column of data accordingly while making the necessary adjustments. Now I'm adjusting these red lines to make sure that they section off the content correctly, and I'm scrolling up and down on my page to make sure that I get all the data on the top and bottom portion of the screen. Next, we're going to click and drag out to create a box. This will highlight the data within all of the rows, and of course, we want to do this from the top to bottom. So what we'll do is we'll just drag this down all the way to the bottom of the document. And as you can see, all of the data within this box and within these vertical lines will be parsed. Once you're happy, click Confirm. At the top of the screen, you'll see a table of all your parse raw data. You can scroll through to quickly preview your data. In this table, you'll notice that there was no data generated for the first column of the document. Obviously, we'll want to delete that. We can accomplish this by adding a table filter. Hover over Alter Column Structure and then click Remove Column. and DocParser just removed the empty column with no data. We can now see that the filtered result no longer shows the empty column and now shows each subsequent column of data from our file. To proceed, we can click Save Parsing Rule. After DocParser successfully parses your document, you'll see the file pop up on the screen. You can view the contents by clicking on the file. And there you have it. All of your data has been parsed. You can download a CSV of this file by clicking Excel Download at the top of the screen. And if you have any questions about this functionality, please don't hesitate to reach us at support at docparser.com.